Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Reed Gregory and I'm Zoe Jones. Today is National Adoption Day and it was a very special one here in Fargo for three families as five children were adopted today. We were there to speak with the parents and organizers and heard what they have to say about this next step in their lives. It's a day that families wait days, weeks, months, and even years for. And on Saturday morning, three families ended their waiting period and stepped into the next step of their lives as they adopted their kids on National Adoption Day. It's been it's so exciting. I mean, it's kind of been a whirlwind of a day, uh, getting everybody here and organize everything, organizing everything. But uh, obviously, we're so excited, uh, especially for the boys. Uh, we've had them for about nine months, and so to now have them uh, finally adopted is, is just overjoyed. The Cass County Courthouse opened up in connection with the Adults Adopting Special Kids program at Catholic Charities North Dakota. It's amazing. I mean, truly blessed to be a part of family's journey from the beginning to this date in court. So it's an amazing day that we're able to be a part um, walking alongside them. Three families adopted with kids ranging from near infantry to teenagers. Each family had their own special hearing with a judge. Then they all had a chance to partake in a celebration after the final hearings. It was there that one family spoke about what the adoption process was like for them to show these new parents that they have support. You're not alone. Um, and it's going to be a wild, crazy ride. It's going to be hard, but it's so worth it. And while these families are starting their next journey, they're not forgetting the path that led them to this point. We do currently anticipate that we will continue with foster care and see where that goes or what that leads for us. Um, we really have a passion for our community and the children in our community that um, are just in need of a home. And so that's something we hope to be able to continue to help with and provide. 